guys. Hi guys. Welcome back to my channel. Today I will be doing the top 10 bad songs by good bands. So last time I did top 10 um, good songs, bad songs on good albums. But now we're going to be doing the top 10 good songs by, there's like going to be bad songs by good, good bands. Like bad song, like bad songs on good soundtracks or albums. And now we're going to be doing like bad songs by good bands. So let's get on with our list with the top 10. Number 10 is All in the Family by Korn. So guys, if you are a Korn fan, you can probably let me know. But if you really like Korn, you must really don't like All in the Family. If you are a follower of the leader fan, I I would get into that. And well, tons of people like this band. It's called Korn. It's a new metal band. I don't really like new metal. Tons of people. Tons of people don't like new metal, so so all in the family. I like a lot of the song from Volvalier, but all in the family, well, is very very bad. Like 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 the singer Jonathan Davis is like is like 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 it's a it's like a rap it's like a battle between like a fight between like Jonathan like the singer of Corn and the singer of Limp Bizkit. So they're both like fighting, like like telling each other. It's kind of like they're fighting how they don't like each other. And so kind of like they're interrupting each other. It's just w the worst song off of Follow the Eater. So that's number 10, all, the, all in the family. At number nine is Pink Cell Phone by Deftones. In Jesus' name, amen. So let me tell you what, guys. I, I'm a huge and gargantuan Deftones fan, and their album Around the Fur and White Pony were just really good and also Saturday Night Wrist but there's one song on this by this band called Pink Cell Phone. I think Pink Cell Phone is the worst thing they ever created. Died is so Pink Cell Phone is like 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 it's okay at the beginning. It's like it's like 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 Chino's like soft vocals at the beginning and then and then at the end of the song, they're just like, like this, like lady making fun of British people. And one of the words she says is that British people have bad teeth. And what does that even mean? And I'm just saying, what on earth, Chino? What happened to your mind? Why, Chino? Why? It's just super bad. Why, Cheeto? Why? They don't have blue jobs there because they're uncertain. Number eight, Propaganda, Muse. <laughs> so, I'll tell you what, guys. I was a huge fan of Muse when I was little. So, her song, Supermassive Black Hole, Starlight. Tons of her songs are good, like Madness, Uprising, and, and I'm Psycho, I guess. And, but, but Propaganda, however, is pretty bad. And it's probably the worst thing that they ever done. Like, it's not the top ten things, worst things that they done, but, but... But propaganda is still awful. So it's like this thing going proper propaganda. I don't want to hear this. It's like electronic um, song. Like it's just one of the worst things we ever created. 
it's just that bad. At number seven, we have Shiny Happy People by R.E.M. So, so guys, I like the album Out of Time by R.E.M. Losing My Religion and Radio Song, but not Shiny Happy People. They hate this song, so that's why we don't play it live anymore. The singer says that it's a, it's a bad song written for kids. And I do not like the song. If, if I would send something into outer space, sent by R REM, R -E -M, I did not want that to be shiny, happy people. Um, this song is bad. It's just boring lyrics, children's music. It's like it's like a band trying to put impress you by playing this music, and it's just way too bad. At number six, we have Young and Menace by Fallout Boy. If all the Fallout Boys love and love Fallout Boy, they would dislike Young and Menace. It's just like you don't want to jam to this like like electronic DJ style god like if you listen to it like it's just that bad i don't like this and i i don't i don't really like it it doesn't sound good it just sounds like it's electronic now not like fallout board i would call it more disappointing than like terrible I think it's good, but it's disappointing. Cause here is Young and Menace for you. At number five, we have Breadline by Becca Depp. Oh, actually, if you are a Mega Depp fan, you can let me know. So I put this at number five. So it's called Breadline. The song is usually just about nothing, nonsense. It's like about this med man who has tons of stuff and he's emotional, but now has nothing. It's very, it's like, it's like dancing on the bread line. What the heck are you talking about? Like, it's very complicated. It's like, it's off our album Risk. And I, well, it's just, um, does not mean anything, it's just man and then nothing. That's usually what the song is about. So here you are. Here's Breadline for you. Number four, Saint Anger, Metallica. Oh, Saint Anger by Metallica. Is just so bad. Like basses, guitar, untuned, untuned vocals, and a literally just this, like like a like a drum that kind of sounds like a fish Fisher Price kit that is broken. I don't like it. Why Metallica? Why? Number three, Fat Lip, Sum 41. So this song is okay, but it's just like this catchy song, like just yelling. It's not rapping or singing. It's just, it's just like this, like rapping, like this high school song, like, like it's like it's like an old '90s song, I think, like. It's good, but I don't like it. It's like, it's like, it's like, go to the party like my doctor told. It's like, go to the party like my name is El Nino. We're drinking and we're doing stuff. And as a kid, it was random. And then I just, you know, like, whatever, blah, blah, blah. I'm not going to do an impression of it, but it's like, like, two, two minutes long of just in this, like, rapping intensity. 
Yeah, I was. Number two, my Michelle, Guns and Roses. I will tell you what, this song is very noisy, and it's like, it's like noisy and crazy. Sing, sowing all your wild oats in another dimension, and it's saying, yesterday was Tuesday, and now it's Thursday, you can see. You're skipping Wednesday. That's what you're literally doing, and then it goes to Mom Michelle. It's like, you're doing like this, like, kind of just like a high school song. You're going like Mom Michelle just because it's catchy. Wow, well, wow, well, wow. Well. Mama shows. I'm not gonna do an impression of it, but it's but it's not the top ten worst thing the singer done. But but my Michelle is still awful. Um, but it's it's kind of awful, not as awful as my world. But my Michelle is still awful. Like it's not the top ten worst things he done, but my world is still awful. So here. But my Michelle's still off of yours. The number two, my Michelle. Number one, downward spiral, nine inch nails. So, at night hearing this song, it's like just noises and Trent Reznor, the singer, talking. It's like one of the worst creations they made. Like, you may be surprised I told Downward Spiral and not um, Mr. Self-Destruct, but that one can kind of fills up the whole album. It's a bit longer, but Downward Spiral is still awful. It's like, it's like him like talking very, very violent. It's like violence and like not appropriate for kids stuff it's like he's like talking violent and like and well well it's it's I'm talking about his life it's like a life is violence and but but it's not even top 10 worst things he done it was it's but but downward spiral is still awful but but it's still awful beyond him saying this, but, well, I am, I don't like listening to this song, but, 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 there's songs that, uh, we had so we put songs on this list that were annoying and repetitive, songs that were long, but, but annoying, songs that had, that were making fun of people, songs that had fighting into them, but all of these things, come to downward spiral it's just that bad so guys that was probably not the list i want to let you know so if you want to know the real thing maybe go to watch mojo and maybe they'll tell you just the right thing but thank you for the watching this video hope you guys enjoyed my video Please remember to subscribe to my channel and click the bell button. See you next time. Bye.